Okay, Castro podcast app for iOS is one of the best podcast apps out there for iOS. And another reason for using Castro podcast apps is to use it for audiobooks, for example, because in Castro podcast app, you can sideload files to your podcast list. But let's start how uh, the Castro app works. When you uh, subscribe to podcasts and so on, they all, all the new episodes and so on, gets collected in your inbox. And that is a nifty feature in Castro podcast app because the inbox makes it possible to subscribe to a lot of different podcasts because you does, doesn't uh, feel so uh, uh, that you need to listen to all the episodes, if you know what I mean, because they all is in the inbox first. And when you decide to listen to any of the episodes in the inbox, you just click on it and add it to your queue, your um, playlist, if you know what I mean. So by clicking on this button, you add that episode to your queue. And if you want to add a file to the bottom of the queue, you can click on that button. And if you have um, an episode that you don't want to listen to at all this time on in your inbox then you can archive it like that and all the episodes that you add to your queue gets downloaded to your phone your iphone and all the episodes that you archive gets uh, archived in a list but th those episodes is not on your phone they are just archived but you can find them later on if you want to listen to those episodes again or another time and so on. But the best feature is sideloading, as I said. But let's see how the queue looks. And here is my queue, all the podcasts that I want to listen to. And as I said, here is the inbox and here is the queue. So if I want to read about this episode, for example, click on that and you can see all the links and the text about the episode and so on and I click and when I click play then I can see the episode in the playlist and you can see all the effects and here is all the great effects in Castro podcast app you can enhance the voices and that works really great because when you enhance voices in podcast, Castro podcast, they all get normalized. So all the voices in the podcast uh, has the same volume and so on. So that's pretty nifty. And the trim silence is an excellent feature. And we have continuous play. That means that it and place the next episode in your queue. They, the app plays all episodes from your queue and no episodes from the inbox. So you have to add the episodes from the inbox to the queue to play them. So that's pretty nifty. And down here you have some um, uh, rewind and forward and so on. And uh, you can see how much you have listened and how much is left from the ap episode and so on. So that's pretty nifty. Okay then, how do I listen to audiobooks fast then with the Castro podcast apps? Well, uh, I use the sideload feature in Castro podcast app and that makes it possible to add your audiobooks that you own, for example, on CD. Here you see CD one of an audiobook. I have that in my queue. All sideloaded episodes, sideloaded files and so on you have gets in your inbox first. And when you have a file there in your inbox, like for example this, you can add it to your queue by just hitting the queue button. Then it gets into your inbox 
like any podcast and whatsoever. And to sideload files, you just drop them in the Castro sideloading folder in iCloud. So for example, from a Mac, you can just drag and drop your audio file, your, your audio book or whatever to the sideloading folder on your Mac. And that file will show up, show up here in your inbox totally automatically. You don't have to do anything else. You just drop the file in your iCloud folder for Castro and it shows up here. And after that, you can just click on it to add it to your queue. So when listening on this, you can see a lot of facts about the books and so on. If you have all the meta tags filled in for this book, then you can read about it. And uh, you can also, of course, um, see a lot of other stuff with it and you can use all the effects and so on. So with an audiobook you can use the trim silence feature and that feature has this is on, the only app that has that that you can listen to audiobooks in. So all the audiobooks apps in the app store and so on doesn't have the trim silence feature. And this feature makes it so much faster to listen to audiobooks. Trim silence is perfect for audiobooks because audiobooks, when people are reading the audiobook for you, they have a lot of silence. So by using trim silence feature with the audiobook, you can trim the, the speed and read the book a lot faster. Listen to the book a lot faster, of course, not reading. But you can listen to the book a lot faster. So you can set the speed for the audiobook and you can trim the silence for the audiobook and you can listen on the book so much faster because of the trim silence. This trim silence feature is so good to have for audiobooks and I don't know why any audiobook app have that feature. I don't know why no other app has that feature. Yes, I know that all the podcast apps has that feature, but no podcast app can sideload files using iCloud more than Castro podcast app for iOS. So with Castro podcast apps, you can sideload your audio files and listen to them as podcast and use all the features in Castro podcast app like trim silence and enhanced voices and continuous play and so on. So this is so cool. So you can sideload your files so you get to your inbox and when you want to listen to the file you add it to your queue and then listen with all the features activated. And Castro podcast app you can do some uh, uh, automating settings so you always have the same settings and so on for a specific audiobook or podcast so you can have different settings for different books and so on so that's pretty nifty too so you don't don't need to do anything so every time a new podcast episode gets added to your inbox and you click add to queue then you will have exactly the same settings as the the episode before that. So you don't need to do any setting changes and so on. And the same thing with sideloaded audiobooks. So the sideloading feature in Castro podcast app is worth every money for me because then I can listen to audiobooks so much faster because of the trim silence feature. That's so good. Okay, I will link to Castro podcast app down below in the description text and you can buy a pre premium subscription to have all the best features in Castro podcast app. But I think it's worth it because it's so good. And the Overcast app has a, a feature that you can upload files to it, but you have to upload your audio files to Overcast servers to be able to listen to them in the podcast app. And I don't like that because I want to have my files in my iCloud account, 
not on overcast servers. So a huge difference. So that's why I prefer Castro podcast app over overcast. So go check it out. Okay, bye.